All right, I got these baby tomato plants here that I'm going to find their forever home here in this row bag. And um, I don't know too much about this variety of tomato. I got it um, from Baker Creek, started it a couple of weeks ago under um, some grow lights. I think they're at least six weeks old. Um, and it's finally, the weather's finally nice enough here in my area to put them in the ground in their forever home. And so what I have in this, what I've put in this um, grow bag in terms of soil is I got my own compost that I um, started actually last year. So some of that is in there. I got some mushroom compost in here, some peat moss. I got some uh some um, warm cast some warm casting in here i also have um some fertilizer it's a dr earth organic fertilizer and um i have some uh this um like i said some warm cast not tea but actually just some earth warm casting is what it is and then um, I like to put a little bit of um, rock dust. It's, I just got in this salt shaker, I guess. Um, I'm not using any more for uh, putting in my herbs. So I put some um, rock dust in there and I just shake it in here. And then I also just use some potting soil, any potting soil that you have. And I also use some uh, topsoil. That's basically um, what I had. I didn't have enough potting soil, so I just put a little bit of um, top topsoil in there. It's just basically dirt. I'm gonna mix all of this up. Then I'm gonna transplant those baby tomatoes in here, and um, that will be their forever home. Once again, this is the variety of tomatoes that I'm gonna be planting in here. Um, and I just mixed up the soil once I put everything in. It was compost, some peat moss, mushroom compost, peat moss, a little bit of topsoil, which is what I had. I had my own homemade compost that I added to this mix. I also added some fertilizer, some Dr. Earth, organic fertilizer, some earthworm casting. Um, some rock dust and I've mixed everything up we'll put some water on it put a hole and I'm just gonna plug each plant in the hole all right so got the tomatoes planted up um, and mulched and watered and um, I got to figure out some type of caging system for them. I haven't decided what I'm going to do yet. I'm kind of pressed for time. So I'm going to just wrap it up for today. And um, I guess I'll just have to, um, once I figured figure out their caging system, I'll have to just post that up. Um, but that's it.